their battles and conquests became legend. And the legend lives on. This is the hour of the gladiators. to the first of the quarterfinals. Only one man and one woman can win a place in the semis. Who will it be? And how will they emerge after an hour with the guardians of the standards? Our gladiators, Taipan and Delta. Hammer and Flame. Commando and Vulcan. Tower, Glacier, Condor and Fury. Tornado and Storm. The audience is ready, the gladiators are ready, and let's welcome our hosts, Kimberly Joseph and Mike Hammond. Ooh. It's a big crowd and a big night tonight. Hello and welcome to what promises to be a particularly entertaining show. And so it should be, Mike, because we have two dancers and a magician waiting in the wings. Sounds a little bit more like a variety of show than an episode of Gladiators. But one thing I know is for sure, our challengers tonight are super competitive people. Well, being the quarterfinals, this means that the challengers have actually come up against the Gladiators once before. Well, let's not keep them waiting any longer. Let's have a big welcome for our first challengers tonight, Leanne Martin and Debbie Santic. Leanne is an award-winning apprentice carpenter from Perth. Her strengths are netball, cricket and karate. And in her heat, Leanne not only won the Eliminator, but she out-jumped Delta in swing shot and grabbed an impressive four points. Debbie is an acrobat, a tumbler, a dancer, and a stunt woman. She's also got time to be a mother. In her heat, Debbie impressed everyone, including the Gladiators, by scoring five points after barging her way through corners. Let's welcome Leanne and Debbie. Welcome back, Leanne. Now, before we start, just let us in on the experience uh, on the job up on the roof. Oh, yeah, I was um, building a shed for my auntie and uncle, and um, just so happened that when I put the last sheet of um, tin on the roof, um, it actually slipped and I just went straight through the roof and fell on the ground and <laughs> it hurt my coccyx bone a bit, but I made it through. <laughs> Fantastic. So you're used to heights? Yes, I am. Looking forward to Skytrack tonight? Yeah, I, probably the only game I am looking forward to. <laughs> Not looking forward to Gauntlet? You didn't have a very good run last time. Um, no, I didn't, but um, hopefully this time I might do a bit better. So you've got your tactics all worked out? Oh, yeah, I could say that. <laughs> OK. Now, what about the other hard-hitting games? You've got uh, Powerball, also Jewel. Yeah, well, they're physical games, and I'm not exactly as big as the Gladiators, but all I can do is just try my hardest and do my best. Well, the spirit's certainly there. Let's welcome Leanne. Good luck. Thanks, Kimberly. Debbie, we just heard that tonight is going to be a very physical game. We've got a lot of the physical games. Now, last time in Gauntlet, you did really well. You managed to get through to the end and get five points. Yes, I did make it right through to the end, and if I can do that tonight and score five points, I'll be happy. Now, there was a lot of sidestepping because you're a stunt woman, so tell us about some of the skills that from being a stunt person or a stunt woman you get to bring to gladiators. Well, there's a lot of skills in body control. Um, acrobating helped me there. We've got body skill, which is martial arts. Um, everything we do in stunts helps me here. Have you had any situations where you've had things planned that haven't quite worked out the way you wanted them to, to work out? Not yet. Oh, yes, I have, actually. We were rehearsing a fight scene one night, and I had my nose broken. Hopefully that nothing like that's going to happen tonight. <laughs> Hopefully not. Now, just while we were standing here, too, you were saying, I wonder where my family is. And we've got about 5,000 people here tonight. Where are they? Right over there. There it is, a sign that says Danger Dynamite, or Debbie is Dynamite. So you've got a big crowd of supporters there, and we're all behind you tonight. Good luck, Debbie. Thanks, Mike. Let's welcome Debbie and Leanne. And now let's welcome our male challengers, Joshua McEwen and Paul Reynolds. Joshua from Victoria is studying to be a teacher. He's a basketball coach, a sprinter, and a high school high jumper. And the last time we saw Josh, he dodged, ducked, and ran up a fantastic score and hit and run with five crossings and ten big points. 
Paul from Sydney was a teenage rugby league rep, and now he's a dancer studying to be an accountant. And in his heat, Paul survived a rugged swing shot game against Taipan, but scored three winning points. Ladies and gentlemen, Joshua and Paul. Josh, welcome back. You're the magician, I won't get you to do any magic tricks tonight, but I, I have heard backstage that something unusual happened with the roommate last night. Oh, uh, last night, apparently, I was in my sleep and I was getting a bit excited, and so I sat up and I punched in the air and I was getting all excited, <laughs> but I don't remember. I heard, I heard someone, the, the roommate told me that you just sat up, bolt upright in bed and said, go, go Joshua, go, you were cheering yourself on. Well, I hope it works, I hope it works. <laughs> now, last time we had you here, we played a game of Powerball, which uh, Hammer is a big hitter in Powerball, but you managed to get the five points and uh, I, hope, I think you're probably hoping to do the same tonight. I hope to get at least that, but I don't know, they hit very hard, Hammer took my head off something chronic and that hurt a lot, but we'll see what happens. Good luck, Joshua. Okay, well, Paul, apart from the last time we saw you on Gladiators, you've actually been on television before. Yes, that's right, uh, Kimberly. I was uh, on Donahue's show uh, many, many moons ago. You've also got an interesting story about a shark on Hayman Island. Yeah, that's right. When I was younger, uh, my parents took me over to Hayman Island with my brother and... Uh, hi, Chris. And it was before my little sister was born. Hi, Annie. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and we dived off the jetty at the, the end of... Uh, at, well, at the end of the jetty at Hayman Island, and... Uh, some people get out, sharks, sharks, and there were sharks feeding there. So we quickly got out of there. <laughs> I bet you did. I bet you wanted to get out of Gauntlet last time as well. The five sharks were uh, approaching pretty quickly. Yeah, it's a very tough game. Um, it's one that I favour, though, so I'll slay any dragon to win it this time. OK, well, you've got it again tonight, so we'll be looking forward to it. Now, what about Powerball? Powerball's another favourite of mine. I'm going to give it a, my best shot. Uh, I've got some great competition with Josh here, so we're just going to go hard and see what happens. Well, it's going to be a great challenge, and we've got two great challenges here. Please welcome Joshua and Paul. OK, well, we're all set. It's the quarterfinals. It's going to be a huge night tonight. Let's get right into it. Ladies and gentlemen, let the games begin.